Mm. What's up, YouTube? This is your girl, Comatic Medium Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. If you're new to my channel, I am a prophetic tarot reader. I do not read cards based off the meanings. I read cards based off what Spirit tells me. See holy angels in the divine. I am also a psychic medium. I am able to connect with those whom have crossed over. Um, I have just recently did um, a reading for the legendary rap artist Mo3, a psychic reading um, slash tarot reading. So if you would like to go check that out, go look at my videos. I also have a video on the Bounce Queen Magnolia Shorty psychic reading. Um, if you would like to check that out, um, it's in my videos. Um, I will be doing, doing, excuse me, I will be doing more um psychic readings uh, as time progresses I also come on here and do blackout messages where I talk about the end times the government preferably the end times preparing for the end times love life relationships astrology politics um, I do readings where it's I'm in the it's, it's dark like blackout messages and then I also do readings where I show my face so um, yeah if you would like any of those readings um, go check those out as well um, I do have small children, so if you don't like small children, then don't watch my channel. Um, I am going to do, I don't know, I don't know if I'm just going to do a collective reading or air sign reading. Probably air sign. I'll see what I'm going to name this like afterwards. I hope everybody is doing well. Everybody is okay. Today was a beautiful day. Yeah, I had like a wig on and stuff, but like I took it off and put my hair up in a bun. But today has just been so awesome. I just thank God for peace, love, mercy, grace. Just so happy to be happy, you know. It's like when you go through things and then God bring you through, you know. It's a, it's a beautiful feeling. So I hope everybody is just doing okay. And like I said, I have small children, so sometimes I might have to stop to them i won't take too long it might be a second or two but um anyhow archangel michael archangel raziel raphael my spirit guides abraham my ancestors um on the other side please give me clear and precise messages do you want me to use this deck or do you want me to use another deck for some reason spirit is telling me to start off with this um I forgot the name of this deck, y'all. But uh, they're like oracle cards. So let's see what Spirit wants me to say. Whew. What's going on? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. I don't know. I got like a real like... A real discombobulated feeling like and I seen the Queen of Wands when I was like shuffling it other day so you guys could be dealing with somebody that's a karmic or something like that yeah you guys could have went through like a twin flame journey because this card says flame tree and then hidden path so you guys could be like on a twin flame journey or something like that I'm just kind of going to like shuffle these cards to see what's going to come out. I don't know. I'm just, I just have like a very weird energy. Like a very negative energy. The Tempest card. Yeah, so you could have been dealing with somebody that was like a succubus or some type of incubus. Some type of sexual energy. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, I feel like there could be like a karmic. You could be twin flames with somebody and they have a karmic partner that's extremely jealous of you because you're a goddess and they see that you're manifesting, creating a life, a very abundant life for yourself with this hidden gift card. I feel like this twin flame is wanting to come towards you. Yeah, because you're this goddess, you're this empress. You have this goddess empress like energy. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yeah, Amethyst. Yeah, you're transforming. They see that you're very confident. You're very abundant. Yeah, you're not worried about this person. Spirit, what is this? Yeah, I feel like 
a lot of people want you stuck in your head, lonely, confused, because it said this card says the search. A lot of people want you stuck in your head, lost, confused, not knowing which way to go. Yeah, but you're 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 a, you have a pure soul. You're very pure. You're very angelic. What is this energy spirit? Because like I really don't know. Like I mean, <laughs> I know what's going on, but it's just like this is like a very chaotic, um, a very chaotic, like weird energy. I just feel like. So you could have been like arguing with somebody or got in tool with somebody. I feel like a I feel like a very heavily like watch energy. So somebody could have been watching you guys. Somebody could be watching you guys, stalking your social media. Holy Spirit, holy angels, tell me what's going on with this Queen of Wands, this karmic, this low vibrational energy. What's going on, Spirit? Give me some messages. Yeah, this person could have been doing spell work. Yeah, this person could have been doing like heavy, heavy, heavy fucking spell work. Like this person could have been trying to like literally, I'm hearing death spells. So somebody could have been doing death spells to try to bring you down. I'm also hearing that someone could be trying to block your spiritual gifts. So if you could be like very spiritually gifted, they're also trying to stop your spiritual gifts. I'm seeing like somebody may be sending some spiritual attacks. Yeah, because they see that you're happy, you're manifesting, you're growing on yourself. Whoever this is, whether this be a karmic, just XP people from the past, people are very jealous, jealous and envious and pissed off because you're happy. You could be going on trips or something like that. You could have recently went dancing or went out to like a club or something like that and maybe you got into it. So what I'm the story that I'm getting is this is what I'm seeing. This could be for a specific person or a few or a few people. I don't, I'm not sure. But you could have went out to a bar or a club or something like that. And you saw this karmic, your twin flames karmic or something like that. Yeah, you saw this king of pentacles. So your, your, your twin flame, your divine counterpart or whomever. It doesn't even have to be. Just take it how it resonates. You may have went out with this person and you saw that this, this, this karmic at this bar or out or something. You guys may have gotten into it. Yeah, this person is very envious of you, jealous of you. Yeah. This reading is like all over the place. What am I getting here, spirit? Somebody in the past, this king of pentacles, whoever this is in the past, could have one-upped you, betrayed you. But now this person is like wanting to come towards you. Yeah. They're going through heavy judgment. Yeah, for what they did to you in the past. Yeah, they see that things have changed for you. You're in a better energy. I feel like at one point you was at the bottom of this wheel and now you're on top. So I feel like this person, this karmic partner, this king of pentacles, whoever this couple. I feel like this is a couple. Like this is a weird reading. Like 808 on the clock. I feel like this is like a fucking couple or something that went against you. And now they're going through judgment. And so they're trying, this king of pentacles is trying to come towards you because they see that you're very abundant. And they see they see or i said they i meant to say he or she but yeah they see so it could be this couple they see that you're very abundant they see that you're growing they see that you change they see that you got a lot of money so you could be like the queen of pentacles yeah you also could have met somebody new you could be dating someone new yeah, this devil energy. Yeah, they want these. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. I feel like there is a couple that have tried to stop you, go against you. I feel like they're also sending like spiritual texts. I mean, yeah, spiritual attacks trying to stop your um, spiritual gifts or something like that. I'm hearing. Yeah, they're heavily watching you. Nine oh nine on the clock. What is this spirit? Give me some more messages, please. Hold on, you guys. I feel like this is just like a weird energy. I'm getting like a karmic couple or like you. I'm seeing like a couple that's in cahoots or something like that. Holy spirit, holy angels, please give me some messages, please. 
clear and precise messages. Yeah, they wanted you stuck in your head. And y'all remember I told y'all what happened to this car. And my baby was eating it up. But anyways, yeah, with this nine of swords, they wanted you like stuck in your head in the past. Or maybe you were stuck in your head in this past. But I feel like there's a group of people or this. I feel like I'm heavily. I don't even think it's necessarily a group. I'm heavily seeing like a couple that's just, yeah, they're sending spiritual attacks. So you could have been have like, like. People could have been sending you, like, uh, negative energy in the dream state. So maybe when you go to sleep at night, people could be sending you attacks while you're dreaming. Yeah, so if you could be, like, up late at night or something like that and not getting no rest, you know, I feel like that's spirit protecting you, helping you change your sleep patterns. Yeah, these people are blocked off from you. Yeah, the spirit is is, is 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 blessing you guys. I feel like you guys have an overflow of abundance. And these people see that and they're wanting to stop that. Yeah, and you have your guard up. You like no fuck no. And not only do you have your guard up, the divine spirit is protecting you from this devil energy. Yeah, you're very, very freaking protected. Because these people try to one on up you, talk about you, gossip, um, spread negative energy about you yeah i feel like there's also a twin flame a divine counterpart that's wanting to freaking like sleep with you they said they may be sending you a lot of sexual energy like at nighttime yeah doing like i said a lot of black there's a lot of heavy black magic going on this couple these people i don't know who this could be but there's like a lot of freaking like fucking black magic going on and they also see that you're manifesting yeah they're going through major tower moments this freaking king of cups yeah Anything else, Spirit? What is what is this? I feel like there's a lot of conflict, a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing going on behind the scenes. But you're not dealing with that. With this sun card, you're very happy. And that's what's pissing people off, that you're very happy. You're working. Yeah, you're in the Nine of Pentacles. You're working on yourself with this Wheel of Fortune. Things have changed for you. You've sown good seeds. You're reaping great karma. Yeah. Yeah, and like I said, spirit, you're blocked. These people, so you could have ghosted these people in this past, this person. I'm specifically hearing like a couple. So you could have, this person could have ghosted you. And number 12 on the clock, that number could be significant. This person could have ghosted you in the past or you ghosted them, either or. But you're blocked. Spirit is this person. I feel like this person is like spiritually, yeah. This, yeah, because this person with this Knight of Cups, this person was very childish to a 12, 15 on the clock. This person was very childish, very low vibrational in the past. Yeah, this King of Pentacles, like I said, this person is very abundant. But I feel like this person had a choice between you and several other karmics or several other different people, parties. And they didn't want your offer in the past. They didn't want to choose you. Yeah, now this person is stuck in their head. They're watching you. I feel like their karmic is watching you. Yeah, this person really doesn't have anything to offer. I feel like at one point they were like a king of pentacles. They were like very financially stable. But now they're fucking page of pentacles. They've lost all their finances. They're wearing a facade. That's why they're wanting to come towards you. Yeah, but I feel like this person still wants to juggle you. Juggle you. This person really just wants to come towards you because they feel like you're abundant and you have money or something like that. This person wanted you at a standstill, not knowing which way to go. And I feel like that's what they want. They want to come back and take some of your energy or take some of your money or both and try to keep you stuck they want you back to this because they wanted they i feel like when i'm hearing this person it was easier when this person could use your energy yeah, I feel like this person may have did a lot of spell work at nighttime, late at night. I'm seeing like candle magic or something like that. Yeah, this person sees that you're very unbothered. You're not worried about them. You're not really caring about what's going on with them. 333 on the clock. Yeah, you're not concerned. You're not really concerned about what's going on with them. You don't care. Yeah, and that's what's pissing this person off. I feel like this person also may want to gift you something. Yeah, this person may want to give you a... Uh, if it's not like an actual gift, this person is wanting to come in and give you a love offer. Yeah. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, any more messages, please? Yeah, because they see that you're a star. Yeah. Yeah, this emperor. This, this, this part, this emperor was supposed to be your divine counterpart but this person had several choices and they've betrayed you and they see that you are the star this person could have shitted on you 14 14 on the clock this person could have shitted on you thought you wasn't good enough thought that they that, that they could get better than you and i feel like this person is in heavy regret because not only are you blocking this person 
or or whatever the spirit the divine they're blocking it this person is spiritually blocked from you this person is blocked completely because they didn't do the work so you guys could get to this ten of cups so i feel like the spirit is going to bring you somebody else in that's willing to do the work that's willing to you know do what they need to do yeah yeah, you guys are very hermetic. You could be in hermit mode. You guys can just be really focusing on yourself. So if you're not dating anybody or seeing anybody, you guys are just focusing on yourselves. 15 on the clock, angel number 15. Yeah, yeah, this person is stuck in a hangman energy, not knowing which way to fucking go. They're looking crazy, sitting up. I'm saying that this person could be like in conflict with a lot of people. They could like owe a lot of people money. I'm hearing bankruptcy. I'm hearing eviction. I'm hearing repossession. So this person could be like losing their car, losing their home, dealing with a lot of court cases. Yeah, and this person just steady sees you working, working and getting to your abundance. Yeah. Yeah, this person is very jealous of you, too. If this person is not jealous of you, they're karmic. Yeah, you've sailed on. you moved on to karma waters. And that's why this person is in deep regret. They're in deep fucking regret because they know they betrayed you. They broke your heart in the past. This person was very cutthroat, evil, envious towards you, nasty, jealous-hearted, spiteful. Fucking, they could be a narcissist or have some type of narc tendencies. And, like, look at all with this Eight of Cups. You had a lot of fucking love for this person. And this person had no fucking reason to betrays you betray you this could have been multiple people yeah because they know that you're very loving you, you you could be this queen of cups they know that you're very loving sweet you're a sweetheart you're caring yeah and this person left you out in the cold in the past so i feel like now they're in that energy y'all a lot of these readings are like very fucking repetitive i be wanting something else like spirit gosh no disrespect collective but yeah this person was doing heavy heavy black magic man like heavily let's see see is there anything else i was on a star to find out where you are that just came to my head out of nowhere so this person could be up late at night hoping and praying and wishing that you get back with them i wish on a dream I got the words right and i think of all the love or what she say and i think of all the time that we spent and i think of all the love that we or would or something she said could have been i feel if something should make up baby I feel it's time that we should get back together. No, 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 baby, we went together. Is that how it goes? I think that's how it goes. Yeah, I don't know. I was on a star to find out where you are. That make me think of baby boy. Y'all know, like, when Yvette came to the door or something like that, and she was like, Jody, he don't love me no more. He don't love me no more. Get me out of here. <laughs> Y'all love that fucking movie, bro. Like, Tyrese ass, man. He used to be so motherfucking fine, man, with his chocolate self. Like, from, like, that Coca-Cola commercial. Ooh, sweet lady, would you be mine? We love for a lifetime. He is so fine. Not no moto. I don't know what the hell happened with his ass. Like, fucking, man, ever since he started going on them fucking trips with fucking Will Smith and fucking Dwayne Martin and fucking Dubai, ain't no telling what the hell. Fucking Tyrese ass looks sick. He's sexy, though. And he ain't sexy like he used to be. But anyways, y'all, let me quit being random. Yeah, this motherfuckers is sending you devil energy, this high priestess. You could be this high priestess. You could be, like, very spiritually gifted or just into highly intuitive. So you know what the fuck is going on. Yeah. Like I said, you could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Virgo, a Taurus, Gemini. Yeah, this emperor is really, really want to come towards you. What I'm getting is, this is what I'm seeing with all of this 
there is a karmic who's very upset that your emperor have done the work or whatever. This emperor could have been in very heavy devil energy in the past. Y'all, what is wrong with this? I hope y'all can see me. But anyways, I'm, I'm going to cut this light on like that. There is an emperor who's wanting to come towards you. They could have been in heavy devil energy in the past. Excuse me. They could have been in conflict, wanted to fight, argue with you. I feel like because this karmic had did heavy spell work. But now that this person... This person is in deep regret. This person is wanting to heal things with it with you. So you could be this high priestess. This pe this person could be like heavily fucking watching you. So this person is like really wanting to come towards you and like fix things and like make things right. That's 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 what I'm seeing. So Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, give me something else, please. What is this? My my sage is going out. I just keep hearing that song. I wish it on a star to find out where you are. So this person is like hoping and praying that you take them back. I feel like this person could be like afraid of like rejection or some shit. Like they're there. They you make this person nervous. They could be like afraid to like fucking reach out to you. And I think of all the time. That we spend. Let me see what my keeper deck says. And I think of all the love that we or would or could have been. I don't know the words, y'all. I think it's time we should make this, baby. I feel it's time that we should get back together. Twelve twenty-one on the clock. Da na na na, baby, when we're together. Okay, Spirit, I'm done, y'all. <laughs> I wish it on a star. Yeah, this is your divine counterpart. This is your official person. So I feel like this person could be fighting this karmic partner in court or some type of like having to pay like spousal support, child support, or all the above. This person is like fighting this person in court. This karmic partner is not wanting wanting this person to come towards you. This karm they see you in high honor. Yeah, they see that you're working hard on yourself. Yeah, like I said. Yeah, I feel like this could be multiple people. Like I said, y'all, this reading is like all over the place. I think I'm going to name this a collective reading. So just make, yeah, just take whatever resonates, leave what don't. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this person could have had a family with this person. Yeah, and this person is sending heavy spell work. Yeah. Yeah, this person is dealing this with this courthouse adjudication. This person is dealing with some type of court case. Your person, your official person, your person is dealing with something. Two, 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 two on the clock. This person is dealing with some type of court case. Some something that has to do with a family, children, the community. Yeah, something, something. Yeah, this person is in despair because they they have to all pay this um this 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 karmic um some type of money. Could be child support, spousal spousal support. This mature male, yeah. This is your official person, and this has this has this person in despair. This person is really stuck in their head, and they frustrated with this. What I'm hearing is this person feels stuck because they want to come towards you, and they don't know what to do. This person is wanting to come towards you and go sell off in the distance horizons, but this fucking karmic partner is like fighting for dear life to keep this person stuck. This person, this karmic does not want this person coming towards you, talking to you, dealing with you, nothing. This privileged lady, yeah, because, yeah, because they know that they're going to be in poverty. I feel like this person is going to have to pay this person, um, this, your, your masculine is going to have to pay this karmic an equal amount of money, but this person does not want to let this person go because they're not going to be able to continue to live a certain lifestyle that they're living i feel like they're going to get an equal amount of money but this person is going to have to go out and work go out and get a job yeah yeah this person sees you you're masculine your divine counterpart your twin flame they see you as very mature you've you've come into a lot of money sudden wealth something like that they're wanting to grow with you you could be expecting some type of unexpected income this person is very much in love with you because i feel like i'm picking up on different energy so i feel like what i'm seeing is is that some of you could be dealing with somebody that's just wanting to come towards you to fucking like use you take advantage of you and then some of you actually have like a divine counterpart that's really ready to come in and like fix things with you yeah 
like with this thief, like I said, somebody could just be wanting to come towards you to fucking like they see that you gotten some sudden wealth, some sudden wealth, some some, some or you're about to get some unexpected income and they're wanting to come towards you because they're dealing with a court case. They has a lot of um uh, things going on. Yeah, look, that's what I said. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this stuff, like, y'all, this energy gets so fucking repetitive. This person could also be facing, like, some fucking jail time or something. So, whatever going on, you guys, I don't know. It's just, like, very freaking repetitive. Like, y'all, I'm going to try to see if I can come on here later and do some other type of reading. Because it's like, it, it's like I, I know I'm not the only damn tarot reader that be picking up on the same shit. These stupid-ass karmics. You know what I'm saying? Still doing the same shit. You think they learned their lesson by now. Yeah, but you guys are seen in high honor. The sp spirit is a blessing, you guys. You guys are heavily protected. So, y'all, I'm finna get up out of this. And if you and, and if you don't reconcile with this past person, I look, false person. So, like I said, some of these people, like I said, somebody could also just be wanting to come towards you to steal and take in. Because they see that you're on your path, you're on your journey, and they're wanting to steal and take from you. And now they want to give you a love offer because they see that you're the star and they see that you're abundant. But, yeah, let me get out of this energy. It's, it's repetitive, you guys. But, anyways, you guys, my name is the Comatic Medium Prophetess. I thank you for watching my channel. If you would like to donate to my channel, my cash app is in the description box. If you would like to email me and ask me questions my email is in the description box please hit the like button uh please like subscribe and share let's get the likes up hit the like button thank you and goodbye